Hey everyone, Mango7 here. How are we doing today? Welcome to an episode of Bluestacks, I guess. This is a sponsored video just to get that out of the way right off the bat. And um, they've got a feature here that I want to share with you guys because this is really cool. There's so many games um, in Japan, in China, in Korea, in Taiwan, in all these places that are not English and you can't understand a lick of them. So um, what Bluestacks has done for us is um, allowed us to translate things and pretty easily too. And I've never tried it. My first time trying it with this game. Um, I don't know what this game is called. Wish I could tell you. I mean, I guess we can tell you in a little bit, but we're just gonna um, try this out. So this only works with Bluestacks 4, from what I understand. Um, you can find a link in the description below to download it. Um, and what it does is translates everything on the screen with a really easy button press to any language you want. It's gonna translate basically to your default language. So mine right now is obviously going to be United States English. But if you want to translate it to another language, say French, um, we can do it like that too. And I want to show you that as well because I know there's a really big French community that wants to play Epic 7 and they can't do it. So what we're going to show you at the end too is um, an English Epic 7 being translated to French. So those people that do not have the best English will still be able to play um, that way. So let's start things off here and see what this message says. So it's really easy. You just hit control. Alt and L. That's it. And what do you know? We've got to translate here. So we can say, see the CV here. We can see it says, okay. Um, it failed to translate the name up there, but it did try its best. It says the game needs to download a larger package. You need to allow the storage position. So obviously, um, what that means is we need to download something. So we can just hit escape here or hit the X at the top um, and hit okay. And then it's going to download all the things. So we'll let it download all the things and see. I want to see what she's saying right there. Ooh, what's this one say? I mean, I know what this one says, but it's cool to translate it to see. Uh, it's so awesome that it's this fast. Needs to download new data, about 888 megs. Takes a long time to download. Really accurate translations too, which is nice. Oh, I forgot to check which one was yes and which one was no. Um, determine. Determine means yes. So let's determine it. Um, I also want to see what's there. I'm curious if the download stops. The download doesn't stop while it's translating too, um, which is really cool. It takes a snapshot uh, while it's going. Um, so that's awesome. Hikaru Akao says, well, it's the simplest things. It's the best. I have no idea what this game is. It said something about cooking and I'm all for cooking. So what I wanted to do is just jump into a game completely blind and see if I could like kind of make my way into it. So we'll t uh, see you in a little bit when this is done downloading. And um, I can't wait to cook some stuff with you, I guess. Oh my God. I'm so excited right now. Oh my God. Yeah, this is about up my alley. <laughs> what have I gotten myself into? Oh, nice. Oh yeah. Yep, get that skirt on. Oh, games are so much better over there. Games are so much better over there. I'm so not sure what this is called. I guess I could translate it here, but I wanna, I wanna see this for sure. Wow, the art's actually really good. Um, so I notice it sometimes has problems translating the super big pieces, like the the image pieces. So we'll see um, if it can translate. So it translated the enter the game down there. So let's click that. Um, this also sounds a little loud. So let's enter the game. Oh lord. Now we're in trouble. Um, hopefully there's a guest option here. Uh, I can log in. I can't log in. Register. Guest login! Go! Um, so let's go to guest login here. Uh, yeah. Things are going swell. So we can do the little translate again. I love how fast it is. New server, white rice, <laughs> switch. <laughs> I love this. Let's go to new service. Um, sure. White rice, sure. And start game. Okay, so there's three really good ways for translation features. One is just to be able to play a game in the another language two is being able to translate 
and read and understand the story, and three is for menus, and we can see all of these already. Um, so we can translate a little bit here. Deep darkness, as if it never spreads. So cool. I love being able to do this. Like, how cool is it to be able to do this? I feel that all my consciousness is lost. So this is skip up here. Um, but I kind of want to see, I, I, I kind of want to see who's talking. Oh, there's some voices. Here she is. How much clothes does she have on? I know she's got some. Oh, that's a surprising amount of clothes. I'm kind of surprised. That's a surprising amount of clothes. You've let me down, little witch. Oh, great, the chef woke up. Oh, maybe I'm the naked one. Um, I know somebody's going to be naked here, so I just want to see some more people. Still don't know. Oh, look at the eye. Look at the UI. This is really cool. This is really cool. Oh, she's nice too. So I'm going to hit skip at the top just so we can get into the UI here. So let's hit control alt L again. We can go to the kitchen, the manor, the adventure, treatment, food, spirit, equipment, lunchbox. So cool. I love that it can do this. Um, obviously, it does its best because there's sometimes you can't you can't exactly type all that stuff in one little box with English, so um, really cool that it does its best. And okay, so we're going to follow around the tutorial here a little bit. Um, let's skip this. I just want to go through the menus because that's kind of the important part. As long as you can figure out how to play the game. Choose food spirit. So let's choose a food spirit here. What are our choices? Which one is the cutest? Oh, it's not going to let us. Apparently that one's the cutest. Oh, that one too. And that one. And that one. Why did it make us do it that way? Perfect. So we've now got our team. God, what are they saying? Are they having a little chat? Exchange omelet and mocha. Trigger loading. Okay, so it looks like we need to exchange an omelet and coffee. So let's move those two. Oh, was her name mocha and her name omelet? That makes a lot of sense. This game looks like it needs to be out uh, where we are here. Ooh, there's worlds. Oh, God. See, this is why this is so useful, being able to read everything here. Like I said, this is the first time I've ever been in this app before. I've never even tried this feature before. So we're going to Europa. I'm down with Europa. Okay, I want a different waifu on the screen. Oh, yep, yeah, thank you. What's her name? Creamy Mushroom Soup! <laughs> Her name's Creamy Mushroom Soup! <laughs> oh, I love this game! Oh my god. Ooh, who are you? Who are you, Dark Food Spirit? That's not as funny as Creamy Mushroom Soup. Okay, let's, let's see what else we have here. I'm just skipping until we see the next person coming in. Come on. Let's go. Nope, just them. Okay, so skip that. Who needs a tutorial? Oh lordy. So this is... Purify the area in the first five days, 10 days, 15 days, special goals. Really cool. I love that it can translate all the stuff like that. Like, that's really impressive. I honestly um got the request for this video and I'm like, this is gonna suck. But it's actually awesome. <laughs> Okay, let's go in. This is really, really, really going to be helpful for me if I'm ever looking at new gachas that are coming out in NA. Now I have a way to really take a look at them. Um, and I'm pretty excited here. Are we going to battle? It looks like we're battling. Oh no. Are we battling? Imprinted enemy. The spirit of the food will give priority to attacking the left side. Oh, it attacks the back line is what it's saying. Ooh, cool. Ooh, heart attack. Mushroom soup, do your job. Oh, we're going to pause. So cool. Anyways, um, I think you guys get the idea here how awesome this feature is. One more thing I do want to show you, though. 
is actually Epic Seven. So let's let's go take a look at Epic Seven really quick because I know there's so many people that want to play in French, but they can't. So um, I'm really excited to kind of show this to you because this is perfect for something like that. Um, we do not have a French client yet for E7. So what we can do is just select a guest server here and just... Um, I'm not sure if the app has to reload or not when we change, but we can switch to Francais. Hit exit here. And now our um, blue stacks is in French, as you would if you were a French seeking player. And we can go like this, and um, I believe it translates. So we can read the story in English and all the settings and everything, all the UI, everything like that will be translated to French for you. So um, really good for people that kind of speak a little bit of French and a little bit of English, but not really a lot of it. So um, it'll allow you to follow through the story, also follow through the settings, everything like that, um, without any difficulty for the most part. And I think that's just beyond amazing. Like super, super, super beyond amazing. Um, one of one of the coolest features I've seen in an emulator, and again, one of the reasons I really do like using well. BlueStacks, just because of stuff like this. They're really trying to polish things. Um, yeah. So that's about it. Uh, all the information is in the description below. Feel free to uh, download BlueStacks for there. Feel free to try out the cooking game. See if you can have some creamy mushroom soup like I did. And uh, feel free to try this out because I'm definitely going to be using this in the future. And I'm not just saying that because this is a sponsored video. I'm definitely going to be using this and I can see myself using it for um, future gacha games 100%. So thank you so much for watching. Feel free to like, comment, subscribe as always. And I'll talk to you later. Bye, everybody.